Hello, so today I will present my our project title MLDC which means Makan Not Di Cafe. My name is Ahmed Kadi bin Sufyan and my friend name is Muhammad Azmi Zantan bin Asmali and Nurul Iblisham bin Suhardi and our supervisor is Puan Musharafina binti Abdul Rahman. Firstly, introduction. Makan Not Di Cafe is an online food ordering system application for of food ordering and deliveries from Polytechnic Cafe. This includes online food order management, reservation management, processing, and many more, thus make it easier for customers, especially Polytechnic students itself, to order and buy their food anyway, anytime. The application is just an, the application is just one tap away from the mostly available platform. It is our smartphone itself. The user have to launch the app first and select food or beverages beverage depending on what they want and desire to order from the available selection menu at the top of the app next select your favorite stall choose your meal and add to your basket list when you when you submit the order your order number and total amount of your order will be shown on the app once ready the user just have to wait the order being processed and for the delivery next is problem statement in today's age of fast food and takeout, many cafe have choose many cafe have chosen to focus on quick pre preparation of order and delivery. All of this order system we were placed to the waiters or over the phone. At the at the peak time, there are many students want to buy food and drink at the cafe. So the cafe area will be crowded place since along with the pandemic case and the standard operating procedure being enforced, it is quite difficult and students not allowed to be crowded to order their food and drink. Second is price are not fixed. Because the price of each item not written, it will be confused about food price and there is no fairness with the price given. Lastly, the, lastly there is no waiting area at the cafe, even more so the peak time and the and we need to wait a long time in the cafe just to order and wait the meals ready. So this is our objective. First, the main objective of the project application is to help avoid crowded situation in line with the pandemic cases and standard operating procedure being enforced. Moreover, it helps save student time because there is, there is no need to line up and wait at the cafe. Second is fix the price. This is not shown by the store owner by putting a price tag in the application so student or any customer were able to know the price according to the price set by the store owner and provide fairness to the price to everyone. Lastly, with the application delivery service will be provided, hence it will is the customer to get an order. Does customer that order through the app don't have self pick the order instead just wait for the delivery. This is our scope. They have three scope which is admin, customer and stall. So next is project significance. Significantly cafe is usually preparing food and drink based on the daily sales. Sometimes they might prepare more or less based on the estimation of daily sales. By ordering food through these apps, the store owner will prepare the food order taken prior break time and will eventually minimize the waste. Not only that, the student does not have to rush and crowd out and only need to order the meal and just wait for the delivery instead of queuing up for the long time for the for order and payment at the counter. Thus, with these apps, both customer and the cafe will gain benefits. Moreover, since along with the pandemic cases and the standard operating procedure being enforced, we want to find solution and alternative to help avoid the minimized crowded situation at the cafe area. Without this app, there are the there are several problem will be pro protracted such as the price of the food and beverage are not fixed and confused students have to line up and conduct that will come more negative impl 
implications such as the COVID-19 issues. This is a project benefit. Make first make the ordering process easier. Second, the convenience of mobile ordering, and lastly, free and cheap marketing. This is a project impact without with our application. Student no need to waste time to line up for taking order at cafe. It will be easier to student to taking order. So this is our admin GUI. First admin must log in this app. Second, then click customer list, and finally customer list will be shown. This is our customer. Cause uh, first user must create new account. Second, after user create new account, user must log in the apps. After that, the user simply select stall number as shown below. Then, after that, a menu will be displayed. Then the user just tap add button to order. After that, you order list and total order will be will be shown in the page in the next page. If the you if the user has already confirmed the order, the user just tap proceed the bar and your order will be processed by the stall owner. This is a stall uh GI. Stall owner just log in the apps, then stall owner can see the order list from the customer. The conclusion the some things are from the project that we are up to. We are trying to innovate something to help polytechnic community along with the current new world pandemic issues and the standard operating procedure being enforced with the objective as, a, as our guideline to devel develop the project. This application was one of the other alternative and ways to avoid the, and minimize the problem faced by the polytechnic community for a long time such as a crowded problem and confusing and not fixed prices for the meals. Moreover, with the delivery service and the system provided, we surely give benefit to all community. The application we develop hope can give a big positive impact and implication to the community of Polytechnic and continue to bring ease of the near fu future for the better life. So at the, at the end of the this presentation, I will show you how our system works. So thank you. So this is our system. So cafe stall owner must log in first. So So dari sini dia akan dapat lihat uh, order list daripada customer. So next is uh, admin. Admin must uh, log in the username and password. So admin akan dapat melihat customer list lah. seperti nama, email, and phone number daripada customer yang register ke dalam aplikasi ini. So, yeah. Okay, untuk customer pula, customer perlukan button customer ni, and then login lah tapi kalau dia tak ada pernah tak pernah buat account dia kena buat account baru and isilah maklumat anda di sini
tu Isilah di sini balik Untuk login Ok Lepas tu hmm, Customer tu kena pilih Tool mana yang dia mau tengok Menu kan stol satu terus order tak ada kan et nasi lemak nasi ayam nasi penyet terus tu terus order dan ini pas awak confirmkan ini order tu awak tekanlah proceed order lepas tu semua order yang awak buat tu akan pergi ke Stole form, stole form punya tu. 